Hey, what's going on? I'm Brandon Marshall. I'm an artist, and I love Memphis more than you. I really didn't take any art classes at all until about my junior year of high school. I knew some basic drawing techniques and things like that, but I never really got really deep into art until I started painting walls, until I started uh, kind of doing more of this stuff. Just kind of wandering around and seeing murals and, and graffiti art and street art and things like that and just uh, trying to go out with my friends and learn what I could and, and that's really where my passion started to grow for it and, and then I started to transition more um, from kind of street art and, and murals and graffiti art to more um, traditional canvases but you know I've never had any, any painting classes per se other than what I've learned uh, through this and I use those same techniques that I use on walls with the spray can and my fine art and using the brush strokes and things like that. There are a lot of artists that I like and that are really good and talented. Um, but I think most of my inspiration comes from just like my daily life, from the people and my surroundings and things like that. So yeah, some of my, my more known projects around town I guess are with the the I Love Memphis walls that I've done is for a campaign that was started by Carrie Crawford in the I Love Memphis blog. So I was chosen to the first one. It's kind of become a monument where people, everybody takes photos down there. They take wedding photos, graduation photos, family photos. It's really cool to drive by and be able to see people kind of post up uh, next to it, taking photos in front of my in front of my wall. So yeah, I recently got engaged on, on Christmas. I just made something up and said I had friends in town and they wanted to paint, so I came on Christmas Eve by myself and, and just painted this wall and she was kind of still sour about it on Christmas Day. And then I, I said, well, let me go get a photo of what I painted last night. And she was kind of like, uh, kind of pouting the whole way here. And, and we came here and, you know, I, we got out and I just said, what do you think of the wall? And she looked up and saw it and it said, will you marry me? And she was pretty surprised and pretty excited about it as well. There are a lot of little things I love about the city. It's a city with history, and it's always been kind of on the world stage for creative people, and I like that about Memphis. And I don't want to leave now because because I want to I don't want to leave and then come back and jump back on the bandwagon after Memphis has made a name for itself again. And I can feel that starting to starting to happen again. It's starting to come around to where people are um, starting to recognize us again. We're starting to to be known again as a place for creative people. Everybody's pretty cool and humble for the most part and just open to everybody else and um, start to appreciate just the soul and the energy that the, the city has. 